One suspect fatally shot. Now, take a look behind me. You can see detectives are here, and we we're set up for a press conference slated to happen any minute now. They are going to brief us and update us on all the details still outstanding as far as this uh, investigation goes. Now, this is Beverly Wood and Helm Avenue, and as you can see, it is still closed off here. A SWAT team is still here. Detectives are here, which is pretty standard protocol when it comes to an officer involved shooting. But take a look at this video. This is from earlier this morning. Sky 5 was overhead. And you can see the suspect's body covered in front of the lawn of the house. The suspect was shot around 7 this morning. We're hearing the suspect crawled from a side window and stood in the driveway, then allegedly began charging at officers. And that's when officers opened fire, ultimately killing the suspect. Now, it's unclear if the suspect was armed and if there was any sort of exchange of gunfire. It all started around 3.30 this morning. Police got a call about a burglary in progress. We don't know if anyone was home at the time, if an alarm went off or who called police. When officers arrived, they were able to catch and take into custody three suspects. One suspect, however, remained inside the home, barricading himself inside, prompting a standoff that lasted several hours this morning. A SWAT team was called at some point. Also, a fire was reported. LAFD responded. We did see some smoke from the house. We don't know to what extent the house was damaged. Now, back out here live again, you can see that detective. They're getting ready for a press conference conference this morning, but for now, that is the very latest. I'm Lena Bovin reporting live here in Beverly Wood. We'll send it back to you in the studio. Okay, Alina, thank you for that update there. We're learning more about a shooting that left two men dead outside of a popular bar in San Bernardino County. Deputies say the two men got into a shootout Saturday following a hit and run crash on the 210 freeway in Highland. Investigators say 38 year old Jonathan McConnell was riding a motorcycle when he split lanes, crashing into a car that 37 year old Aaron Harris was driving. Harris's two young children were in the car with him. Detectives say McConnell took off. Harris then chased him down to a parking lot in front of Joy's Lounge on Baseline Street. McConnell then allegedly approached the car and Harris began shooting, McConnell returning fire. Both men were killed. A third man was shot in the hand. Harris's children were not hurt in the shooting.